Well, hello, good morning. This is MBO9 2019. It's the 23rd May 2019, aforementioned year, and it's four o'clock in the morning, British summer time. I'm off to Bristol. There will be fine ales. Um, I've been debating what to call this Beano. Originally, it was going to be called the Election and Smock Beano because it's the European MEP elections today. However, I'm just going to stick to politics and smock because I fear there's going to be a lot of politicking today. Smock, well, cast not a clout till may be out and there may be some rain over the period. However, I have a feeling <laughs> it's going to be boiling. Anyway, next stop, Newport train station. All ready for electrification, but no wires yet. This is the joy that is Newport station. It's a nice day. So far, glad I got my smoke. Ten for needs, and I think. Yep, we came in on time. I can't stop here. The spoons. Okay, brackies. Spoons, bacon, and coffee deal. All you can drink coffee. However, not all you can drink bacon. Well, I'm checked in, and it's only quarter past nine. And I'm not sure if this is Bristol or Amsterdam, but everyone's on a bike. That was a bike. The noise, anyway. Um, train spotting. I'll be doing a lot of it. We're starting properly now. <laughs> there will be beer. This is the commercial rooms and the spoons. <sighs> and then probably a curry. Not Adam. It's pretty good here. Ooh. Anyway, we're talking about beer. I'm drinking a stout. And it's 5.6% alcohol by volume, so maybe a little bit of a breakfast beer, he says. Hammerhead Stout from the Milestone Brewery, and they are in Newark upon Trent, where the Newark Air Museum is. Mm. Okie dokie, <coughs> looks nice. Mm. It is so tasty. strong and it's quite malty. There's some burnt oats in there. Burnt oats in the finish. And it's bitter in the finish as well. B plus in a bit. And we're back to mild May. This is Rudgate's Ruby Mild at 4.4% alcohol by volume. There is a curry arriving. This is where I am. <coughs> anyway, Ooh, nice and cool. Slightly malty aroma. Mm, really malty. A bit caramelly, hint of burnt notes in it as well. Burnt bitter finish. B plus in a bit. Well, the curries are right, and it smells really good. So, post curry, the more beer co. And I'm about 50 minutes late. I don't know what he said. Anyway, um, Pittman's been on this morning's video. No sound. TLDR, the flip switch on the headset for audio, flipped up. 
Anyway, this everything's in the notes. It's probably better not to listen to what I say. So, let's get some beer. Two things. I got one, I don't think it's safe. And final alert, agent of evil, the Cody. 70% alcohol by volume, a black IPA. Get in trouble for that, no doubt. So this is Radiance, 5% alcohol by volume, a continental blonde. It is on keg, but I was offered off task, off gravity. And apparently, cheap Thursday or something like that for cask. So I was in. Yeah, and there was spillage on the last one. It was all my fault. But maybe kiss me. Wonderful. So, oh, really nice, nice aroma. Sort of fruity and maybe a little bit malty. We've got some normal, we've got one so hot left, we've got raw, we've got illusion, you know. Malty, fruity, a little bit tropical. Oh, the illusion, that is. That's really nice. And then the table's a bit off, but big plus in a bit. I've lost completely the Sweet, count. Yeah, anyway, this is Hoppiness, a crossover IPA, 6.5% alcohol by volume by these people. Oh, wonderfully hot and warm. I think there's a bit of rosin in there. It's quite nice. It's a bit of pine. I'm getting in into oh. those mornings. Yeah. yeah. Um, I've got a snack. Sharp, great food, resin, pines. It's a little bit sharp. Um, it's sunny, it's sunny, it's sunny, it's sunny, it's sunny, it's sunny, it's Google Maps AR functionality came up as preview, but it worked a treat. Oh, looks busy. Okay. This is Solar, SO.LA, 4.5% alcohol by volume from Dark Revolution, the West Coast Pale. Living in Pembrokeshire. I'm thinking no. Right. Okay. Tropical, sweet malt. Kind of refreshing. Can you play some of it? In between my lottery 